Is this the first podcast? It says, yeah, since, yeah, we're since, back in our room. Wait, yeah. I have not. Nick, Nick hasn't missed a, a podcast. <gasps> this is our first podcast that Nick has missed since we started doing the podcast. Oh, you're oh right. Oh my god, oh. this is his very this first. Okay. This is his first. It's okay, you know, first referral. Yeah, strike, 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 strike one, strike one, strike one. You have three. You have I two remember left. before we started the podcast, Nick was like, "Listen, man, I'm gonna try and never miss a single episode because I love you guys so much." And then the I'm first one he misses is now, man. Yeah, I know. This was the first one. I really oh, feel bad. No, dude, it listen, sucks. Listen, listen, I listen, feel listen, so listen. bad. I feel so bad because he like he fractured both of his arms and broke his ankles and got <laughs> hospitalized and then eat yep. back to another city. His dog, like, it, his dog got his head chopped they didn't, off. So the issue was like they didn't it's have okay. a uh, MRI scanner that he could fit into for all of his broken bones at the hospital. So they actually had to helicopter crane lift him to the local zoo and throw him in the scanner where they throw the giraffes and the hippos. They throw the, yeah, the big fat yeah, orangutans. Nick, Nick has been traumatized. He bought a goldfish and he flushed it on accident and he actually ended up um, eating it. Um, how did, how did was, that happen? I don't know. He like, has a poop addiction. He thought it was a piece of poop. No. <laughs> I heard the MRI wasn't big enough so he had to use the orangutan MRI at the zoo. Yeah. Oh, poor guy. Yeah. Well, welcome back. The MRI showed an x-ray of a dog so had to like surgically like remove his like oh skeletal God. system. The bit. His bones were pencil human, thin. The two minute long. He had the dog. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Group Chat Podcast episode. Uh, we're back in our rooms and not in Japan. <laughs> um, we are missing Soft Willie. Some tragic things have happened to him. Um, he stubbed his toe. Him. I don't know. He we'll make up something. to take a flight home. We are joined back today with Grunk, <laughs> who we've yeah! missed so dearly. Dude, I have not done a podcast in probably like, like two months. three weeks. <laughs> right, yeah, we, still grunk. Yeah. Well, we tried to get back into the swing of things when we got back. Uh, but it was like it was just so hard. It, it, we, yeah. We so do so it, forgive but. me if I'm rusty, guys. Yeah, he's working <laughs> on it, guys. Okay. He's rusty. Okay, okay. I'm new here. Ugly. I'm new here. Hey, listen, listen, you guys. Dude, actually, fun. like a lifetime of experiences have happened since you guys left for Japan. I yeah, you grew up like I remember. Years. I remember FaceTiming Grunk. Uh, we were at the Tokyo <laughs> Sky Tree. Yeah, you're at the in, big tower in Japan. Uh, and I FaceTimed Grunk, and you know the time zones over here are way different than. <laughs> over there, over here, it's just, it's like an eleven hour difference. So well, I, I'm Facetiming Grunk at like two p.m. Thirteen, and it's like one a.m. and he looks like he just got shaken awake. Like his <gasps> eyes were like puffy, and he didn't know where he was. <gasps> he looked, yeah, you look at the Minecraft zombie. But yeah, we are back from Japan, and uh, before we get things all kicked off here, I'd like to give a huge shout out to Gamer Subs. For being the official sponsor of the group chat podcast, moments before, <laughs> moments before going uh, going live here, we we had a grunk try the new uh, what was anime the anime, anime sweaty thighs. Thighs. Anime yeah. thighs. I'll be flavor. honest. I did. I didn't think this flavor was gonna be all that, yeah. but it is all that. We thought it, it was. Yeah. It was a questionable. Yep. It was a questionable yep. gamble, and Grunk has fallen in love with Dude, the uh, it's, 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 S. It's cream sickles. It it's cream sickles. Loves flavor. anime thighs, man. Grunk loves just. So if you'd like to try <laughs> anime thighs for yourself, make sure to use code group at checkout. Gamersubs.gg. Yeah, link in the description. <laughs> link, link in the description. Dude, you were talking about calling Grunk in Japan. I, I have a quick little story where I called. My mom in Japan, I FaceTimed her when we were on top of Monkey Mountain in Kyoto. Mm -hmm. And she was like, hello. She's like asleep. And I was like, look, mom, monkeys. And they were like, <laughs> like trying to kill each other. And then I felt bad because it was like 2 a.m. And I woke her up to screaming monkeys. <laughs> She probably doesn't even think it was real, like, whatever happened. Dude, I FaceTimed my sister, <laughs> and she was like, oh, my God, let me see. She was like this, like, oh, my God. I'm like, look. And then the monkeys were like, ah! <laughs> I was like, well, I'm so sorry. She's like, oh, my God, it's so beautiful. Oh. I'm like, no. Dude, <laughs> There's like, monkey bound had, like, a little bathroom. It was, like, two inches wide. And I sent a video to my family group chat, and I was, like, taking a shit. And all, all you could hear was, ah! 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 <laughs> I, I saw yeah, you, like, you were, like, you were looking up. You were like, <laughs> they were like, they were like trying to them walking the on the, the roof. Bathroom. Yeah, they were, <laughs> they're, they're all over in. the fucking place. Yeah, man. They, they do. They're so expressionate. Like when you, when you fuck with them, when you, when you troll them, when you fuck with them, they get like, <laughs> yeah, that's not like, even like, 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 like a lie. Like a video. Man. You fake give them something and then pull it away, and they're like, <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, okay. It's like they they show their bottom teeth. And they're just like. <laughs> yeah, they're, by the way, I'm not gonna lie, they kind of scare me. I don't know what facial expression is ready to like rip off my face and like just tear me apart and wear me. It's the open mouth one. Like it's the one. It's, it's that the, one. The, the like, open no, mouth dude. one means I'm fucking mad. Dude, it, 
No, it's just, okay, the Dude, smile one, I think it's nervous. The scared, they yeah, when they're scared, they go... Isn't it it's so interesting? Because they say smiles are the like, most universal signifier for happiness. But why not for monkeys? monkeys? No, so when they want to kill you, they're like this. They're like... No, actually, that's, it's like the complete opposite for animals. When you show teeth, that means you're about to like bite them. I guess I'm going to bite you first. <laughs> Stop! There was um, <laughs> we could literally the entire like episode that we're doing right now. Let's we could talk about, monkeys about Japan all over again. But dude, I want to I want to go back, and this sounds oh, so boy. weird and nerdy, but I want to go back to Japan, all of us and Grunk included. Bring back Cam and Cage, and now that we know what we're doing, Yummy, I am begging you. <laughs> Just I was a monkey that. for a little bit. <laughs> And I, I, looked to away, I looked back and you were still smiling. <laughs> <laughs> it was like 20 minutes. Yeah, that lasted for so fucking long. But yeah, I want to I want to go back um to Japan. All of us would be super, super it'd be super cool. Um, dude, Grunk, I want to like throw you, I want to throw Grunk in with the fishes and see what he would do. If it was oh, his I, first yeah. time and he had to send him to a local train station oh, and don't tell him a word. I think no, 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 I no, would no. I would win. No, Dude, Soft no, Willy, no. if Soft Willie no, couldn't no. thrive, <laughs> like our third <laughs> our third day there, we go to Kyoto and we're like trying to order food. And we try ordering with this guy who does not speak English for I think 35 minutes. We're sitting, I'm not even kidding you. And they have yeah, a patient trip like an pretty, old monk. It was, it was not that long. It felt like that. Well, the thing is, we didn't know you could only have one order. It was a hot pot. I tried to get two things on the menu, and he was like, <laughs> well, no, 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 no. What happened was, he was well, like, I, one order. I was like, I was one. I was like, no, order. two. Was, and he was like, yeah. one. Yeah, I was trying <laughs> to, oh. I was like, the first one order, and I ordered, like, three things, I think, or, like, two things. And then he and it was fine. Out, me and Tanner. Yeah, and the, it's, like, basically, it's, like, slots, almost. He like, thought I, I was I buying for the, the whole two table. slots when there was five of us. Yeah, he so thought I was buying, like, everyone food. <laughs> yeah, it was very confusing. We yeah. even used translate, and it was confusing. I almost yeah. started, like, crying because how mad I was. I was like, no, he doesn't get it. I was, like, <laughs> I was, like freaking out because I didn't know what to do. I was, like, I don't nobody, know. Nobody was more angry than me than when we turned in those cars at the end of the... You. The oh, I have never seen you. I've never seen you argue bad. so bad. I was dude. ready to walk by myself nine hours back to the hotel. I was dude, mentally you prepared. Not, you were not going to yes. walk. You were going to make it happen. Tanner was there. Was, Tanner? I was there. I was, I, you were like, go find Yummy. I was like, okay. I saw him. He was sitting saw, next to like dude. a Denny's. <laughs> and he was like, I'm about to go walk nine hours. Let's go. He pulled up the directions <laughs> of the hotel. He's like, you ready? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go walk. <laughs> like, it would have no, killed you. It would have killed you. I don't know. I saw you arguing with the guy, and you were just like... Uh, because he was full of shit. I don't care what anybody says. Like, I was a liar and a scammer and a thief and a fucking moron. Okay, I, well, okay. <laughs> I, I, what I think happened, and it, it got very lost in translation. Well, Google Translate's not good. It's it's not good for, like... Well, it doesn't even work. No. It's not when good it, when well, the person when it comes you're talking to, to is a scammer and a liar. When it comes to the phone, dude. <laughs> well, see, what happened was it was because you checked off the box that says you're going to do something. You're even though there was a the fee if you didn't. No. Even no. though there was a fee that you didn't yeah. if you didn't. <laughs> Dude, do you know what that means? It he means he took if I your, you know, he took your word, and he like they're very like based on like respect and like. That's word what of mouth the guy and, who no. was, who literally lives. That's what the guy said. It's like once you say yes, once you agree to you it, have to they're do gonna it. hold you to that to the end. To literally, like you're, hands if thing. you're fucking yeah. dead on the floor, they're gonna grab your body. They're gonna puppeteer you to do it. No, you That's guys just, can't. You guys can't maneuver this into some kind of like disrespect thing because it wasn't disrespect. He it was disrespectful. Wasn't, it wasn't. He was full of shit. I'm trying to explain to you why that. <laughs> and I'm explaining to you yummy, legally. Let me explain the, the whole wrong. situation. You're in the wrong, no matter legally, what. this is what happened. Okay, <laughs> I have a fucking documentation of a piece of paper. Okay, don't wreck the car. Bam, check. Okay, don't be a dumbass and drive with your fucking feet out the window. Bam, check. Don't text and drive. Bam, check. Okay, fill up the car with gas. If you can't, then you pay a fee of 200 yen per liter that the car is at full. Okay, check. Guess who can't fill up the fucking car with gas because they got to go to a fucking studio across Tokyo and, and right, it's right a, now. Man, it's almost closed. The entire place is closed. You All right, back so like yeah, there's more context. There's more. Co we yeah, got back at 6.45, right? Mm -hmm. yep. We're like, hey, we don't have time. Sorry, can't fill up. We'll pay the fee. We'll pay the fee. We'll, we have money. We pay fee. Let's go. Let's do it now. So then they're like, no, you have to go fill the cars up and you have to pay the late fee. You know good and well this would happen. That's what he typed out on Google Translate for me. <laughs> you so you know good and well this would happen. And he's and then the late fee was 8,000 yen, which was like 65 bucks, which was like total bullshit. So he wanted me to, instead of paying like, like $15, he wanted us to go take all the cars back out in the fucking dark, go fill them up 15 minutes away, come back late, and then pay 60 bucks each. Yes. So like over $200. 
Oh, Instead of just paying like up, 20. Filling up the gas tank. Yeah. yeah. In the dark. Yeah, Nick did. In the middle of the night. Nick did. Listed. And we were stranded. And we were absolutely stranded in the middle of nowhere. And by God's grace, we made it home. We literally okay, actually, made it home. Just, I just actually thought. Uh, go ahead. I actually thought we had to walk nine hours. Like, I was prepared to trek. I got yeah, snacks. That was, that I was, was like, honestly, right. that was one of the scarier moments because I actually did not know how we were going to get back home. Well, there's, Can you there's imagine walking nine context. hours in Japan? There's more context. There's way more context. It was there's the fact that, um, so we rented these cars and that sounds like, yeah, whatever. They're just fucking cars. There was an R32. Three. Three. R33, which is already $150,000. Um, That's not $150,000. It was a six-figure digit U.S. dollar. Mm. It was a lot of money. The R35. No, the R33 is like, the R33 the is like 60 grand. It's like 60 and there was grand. also a fucking what? Mark something Supra. What was it? Mark IV. Mark IV Supra. Mark IV Supra. Okay, these are all very expensive cars. We didn't really want to do it. We already had like a very hard time navigating through the thin streets of Japan. It was like it was impossible. Talk about the vagina cavity. I was low-key scared because Yummy was freaking out, and I was like, "Dude, Yummy Yummy was like those monkeys. He was like freaking the fuck out." I was driving like this. I was driving like this. (laughs) Yeah, he was like, "Oh my god!" The whole fucking time, I was legitimately scared of like the fact that dude Yummy was so pissed off. I thought Yummy, I thought you scraped the entire side of a Mark IV suit. Okay, talk about it. Talk about it. Talk about it. I'm gonna say it right now. Yummy scraped it. Yummy did scrape it. No, I did not scrape it. No, I did not scrape it. No, I did it. No, I did it. I mean, they were held together by duct tape. Okay, okay, let's. No, no, no. Then let let the viewers let the viewers at home be the be the be the judge here. I'm going. I'm going because there's footage of it. I'm going to explain it. Okay, so imagine you know those things that hold the light pole. Oh, let's like Grunk do it because Grunk Grunk didn't even see it yet. Okay, Grunk, you know the things that hold the light poles in. To like the ground at Walmart, like the big cylinders, the big concrete cylinders, like the tubes, like the tubes that stick out of the ground for like parking and stuff. Yeah. Like stop yeah. Okay. Cars. Imagine that, but like a little taller. Okay. Now drive twenty miles an hour and have your mirror hit that. Go and through. It goes Dude, far twenty bends miles in. an hour. Like zero. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hour. Hour. Hold on. Hour. <laughs> All right. He's, he's guessing. He like, hit the mirror. Yeah, I'm a, okay. He yummy. It was. Me. You stop space. me when I lie. Yummy. You stop me when I lie. Okay. 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 There's these two. Tall, like he described them, right? Two big tall things, right? And they're fucking. They made the road. The road is fine, and then the road went like that because of them. Okay, because it was mm-hmm. so fucking narrow. And I, I can explain why. It's okay. because the roads were only accessible by every vehicle besides trucks. Trucks were That's not the allowed. Why. That's why through these they only cars. Like so it was now, very, very, yeah. very skinny. <laughs> My only question was, how do you get a truck? To turn around in this extremely narrow, like dirt rice, road, it was literally like yes. a, it was literally a rice field. It was a rice yes. field, and it was it was one single path dirt road. You know what? There's probably blocked, signs we just couldn't block. read. There was, yeah, I was guarantee you, there were signs. I was, looking, guy, behind. Right. Listen, I was looking behind. I was looking behind. Well, go ahead. I was gonna say, God bless the guy who was with us, because um, he didn't oh, know yeah, the area. He didn't know the area. He didn't know the. He saw him Google Maps. And he went there and stuff like that. He lives there, but he didn't know the area too well, so he didn't know that I was gonna be there. It's you know it happens it happens but yeah that was and then what happened was you, we saw that me and Yummy saw that slowed down like everybody else immediately just to, tr- immediately stopped and then yeah no we were like what? Dude, I look at Larry like how are we gonna get through this I was making it look and then, and then and then me and Yummy started smiling like those monkeys and then he slowed down he's like trying to you know get it right and then it it was it was the smallest thing it was it was just, this this was the pillar this was the mirror coming. Oh, I hate that. <laughs> All it did was re-angle. It just re-angled, just re-angled it. It's it's like, it's like off all the paint it. so that the original color... <laughs> I, made it sound, I made it sound so much worse. I was driving with Nick and Cam, and I was looking behind. I was like, how are they doing? I was like, oh my God, he's scraping the whole side of his car. <laughs> okay, he's yeah, got to no. pay like $100,000. <laughs> what happened? I, I saw it. I saw it because I was in the R35 with Cage. So we watched you go... And, we're like, and Cage and I look at each other we're like... Oh. <laughs> oh. Well, no. guess who couldn't drive the whole day, buddy? Me. Oh, that is that is suck. That is gonna blow. You couldn't yeah, drive when we were doing go karts either. <laughs> they didn't have any ages on there. I I got an international driver's permit so I could drive in Japan. How cool is that? <laughs> and it's twenty eight to drive an automatic car. Do you think I drive manual? I didn't roll out the womb and say, "Hey, I think I'm gonna touch the stick shift." And jack it off all day. No, I want to drive automatic. Going to drive automatic in Japan apparently is like a sacred act. Now you unlock at 28 years old. No, No, that's not. That's not why. It's because so the the Mark IV Supra was a manual. That's what I drove. The R33 was a manual. That's what Nick drove. You had to be 23 years old to drive both of them. So we were fine because we both. Even if I could drive stick, I couldn't even fucking drive it. 
Isaac nah. wanted to drive the fucking one hundred fifty or two hundred thousand dollar brand new R thirty five that didn't even have a single scratch on it. But because of insurance policies and how much money that car costs, <laughs> you had to be twenty eight years old to drive it. My That's super was so bad, dude, dude. There was duct tape over the whole front bumper. Oh. There's a reason that car is so screwed up because driving oh, big, oh, fat, oh. bulbous, beast attacked cars <laughs> in throughout Japan is so much harder than it looks. And I, the reason I know that is because I looked at the car and I was like, "Damn, dink there, scratch there, scratch, the window was there. chipped, everything was scratched, everything was there. scratched, all gone, fucking wheel yeah, was like was, falling off, dude. You had to keep beat. reattaching the the, the the fucking wheel, dude." I was turning dude. and I could feel like the like something in the floor was literally going like <laughs> everything. Yeah, I was was we were driving to the supermarket. We had to stop at the red light. I had to readjust the tire, put it back in. I had to like you know, I had to, <laughs> it was bad. It was horrible. But yeah, it was anyways, so stressful. It, it was cool. It was it was very it was stressful. Chill. It was chill. It was so let's make growth when we go back to Japan. Let's no, I'm just gonna drive. Drunk. Drunk. I won't be 23. I uh, know. You don't no, want to no, do it. Trust like, me, you don't want to do it. Grunk. It, it was like. I never saw Yummy so stressed out in his entire life. I thought he was going to, like, kill himself. Okay, well, like, no, to be I fair, like, right that. side. Or, Yummy's always driven, like, this tiny little shitter, like, his entire life. He drives, like, a turd. He's been driving oh, a turd for a decade. <laughs> He's been driving that thing. It is, like, the smallest car I've ever seen in my life. It is very it's so dude, cute. convenient. It's nice. it's, 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 awesome. Awesome. it's perfect. Dude, it's the perfect it, car it to go to Taco Honda Bell fit. at, like, 12 in the morning. It's okay. perfect. Well, using that car yes. and then going to, like, a wide-body Supra, I can understand you. It was, like... It was like the widest car I've ever seen in my entire life. It was, it's, it's it had ass a big old like, butt. God damn it. I wish Nick was here because Nick was the complete opposite of what Yummy was, okay? We had Yummy who was like panicking, freaking out, everything, and then Nick was like, all right, I'm going to go through the most narrowest road on uh, Japan. <laughs> he didn't even like, care. Like, dude, oh my and God. Him, and he was like, like we were recording. We were recording, and he was trying to make fun of, fun of me, and he was like, Yummy, you stressed out? And I'm like, I'm Nick Neanderthal brand. I got no stress in the world. I'm driving a car. I can't read road signs. <laughs> I'm just having fun here. Fucking doing whatever like an idiot. <laughs> because, dude, he was like, just, he was like, I'm cruising. I'm fucking having, I'm having fun. Oh, can't even read what a stop sign is. Doesn't even know what the fucking green light looks like on the wrong like, side of the road. He was like, this is through. a beautiful I mean, day. This is like the life. through. <laughs> He's like, this I is did make it through. such a perfect day. And it, That's all of you guys made it through. And everybody and the, made it through. Listen, I'm proud of all of you. Because all the plus through. side, there's Thanks, a plus man. side. There's a plus side. After driving in Japan on that day, I could drive anywhere in the U.S. with blindfolded backwards in, in literally downtown New York, and I would be less stressed than okay. I was in Japan. No. no. Yes. Yeah, it was yeah. Stressed yeah. Because there, there is one road. There's one road that we have yet to drive, uh, to drive on, and that's the one that's, like, on the side of the mountain. I forget what country it's in. Oh, no. But it's on the side of the mountain. It's in Chile, and, like, I think. Is it? Yeah, 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 it is, it is. And it's, like, really fucked up. It's U.S., really I said U.S., U.S., domestically, I could drive anywhere and not feel oh, okay. anywhere okay. near a stress. Yeah. Yeah. It's because if you chip that car, you would have to pay, like, a billion dollars. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we had, like, no insurance. We had like no insurance. No insurance, yeah. End. And that guy was already trying to scam me, like we said earlier. He was. So. I felt bad because, well, I didn't feel bad for him. I felt bad for the wife. The wife was super nice. She was super chill. She was nice. I she left. Was, I walked away. Super sweet. Got a fucking Dude, boss coffee. But the and... guy, yeah, the guy was like pretty. And then the son was like, like he wasn't doing shit. He was just like not helping. He was like, like, nah, you, you might have to just pay. <laughs> 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 like, right, oh, no, that was yeah. garbage. We were in yeah. like Farmville, Japan. Like we were like far Those are like the most so. traditional. Like everybody was riding bikes. There was one supermarket and like everything else was farms. You described so they hated us. us. <laughs> What? Everybody rides bikes everywhere. It was basically just there was, there was no, no building. No, 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 no. What? No, nobody. Everybody doesn't ride bikes. Specifically in the area we were, it was only bikes and like three cars. When we were sitting in Tokyo, there was traffic every fucking where. Nobody was riding a bike. Hold on, I want to talk about something. Brother, what do you want to talk about now? I want to talk about the what happened after the night. What happened after the night with the cars and what do we do next? What do we do next? Oh, fuck. What? So we were at the grocery store, right? Stranded, literally nowhere to go, no idea. There was no DD drivers, no Uber drivers, none of the domestic shit, but they do have Taxi Go, but you can't make an account through Taxi Go, which is their domestic taxi system, unless you have a Japanese phone number, yep. which really one of us should have paid for a spoof phone, phone number if we could have. But yeah. uh, Cage asked a supermarket worker to call us a taxi, which she did. And then she called us a taxi from the supermarket. We got to the, we, we oh could not God. talk to this guy. Oh we were my, so confused. I, I, I completely <laughs> forgot about this. Yeah, no, hold on. so funny. Oh, we were, shit. we were, uh, how, we were over an hour away from our ho uh, hotel, right? We were mm. over an hour driving, yeah. okay? It was a nine and a half hour walk. It's like, at this point, it's like eight, nine p.m. Like we said, we're in very rural Northeast Tokyo. There is no, no drivers, nothing, okay? This guy just so happens to take us to a train station. We got very lucky to even get to the closest train station because we were so lost. We had no way of getting home. Then that was me, Nick, 
Cage and Cam got dropped off. And then you guys, what happened to you guys? Because I don't okay, even know so how you guys. Okay, so this is what happened. This is what happened. So this is what happened. No, no, let me describe it. What? Yo! What's, what's going, going on, on, everybody? Yo! Yo! And then Tanner, Tanner. What's yo! Going on? Dude. Yo. <laughs> that video. Yo. Was, yeah, we recorded <laughs> okay. the video. Like I, we have, fucking... I have a golden, I have a golden video on my phone of, <laughs> we were... of that, but. Yeah, we were like waiting for the Uber. You guys were, were like you worried? out. No, no, we weren't no, worried. No, I don't no, think no. we were just fucking around. Larry was like recording outside of the supermarket, and Isaac was like, "Yo, yo, yo!" And then he did this whole thing, and then he zoomed in on me. I was like, "Yo, yo." Dude, okay, it sounds dumb right now, but it was the, the funny video was fucking hysterical. I think I think for 15 minutes, Isaac the whole time. What's going on, everybody? <laughs> Loud as fuck at like dude, after dude, dark. There was a there was guy. So, there was like, there was a guy, like, like his like wife, and they were just like looking at us and shit, but. All right. Anyways, we were doing we were, we were we were doing bullshitting. We were bullshitting around for like what 15, 20 minutes. Yeah. So we knew that there was supposed to be the uh, the Uber driver was supposed to come back and pick us up. We knew that, right? So we're waiting us. for that. And then this random ass old fucking fool came with this little like taxi car <laughs> and he stopped right in front of us. Right in front of us. Yeah, it was no like, coincidence because okay. she called yeah. too. No, it was. No, she said she called people to come pick us up. And we we're like, oh okay. Yeah. It's like okay. I was very so, lucky. So yeah, it was kind of okay. So then this guy, the old guy comes, whatever. I don't know what he's saying. <laughs> he was like speaking to me, but he was like speaking in Japanese. I don't know what he was saying. And then I think we were just saying train station. And he was like, all right, that works. All right. So then we got in, we start riding. <laughs> As we're riding away, we see the person that took y'all. Because we told back. him to go back we, to pick them up because we didn't know they had a taxi. Yeah, they were coming back for us and we just totally yeah, so like yeah. passed this them. guy. This guy was driving back. We watched him, looked at him in the eyes, and then he kept on going behind. He went to go pick us up, but we were yeah. in the, the second uh, taxi already on the way to the train station. Yep. But we didn't know He was know like, looking happening. for like a, a couple of homeless men and he couldn't find anybody. I felt bad. I wonder how long he was like driving around trying to find us. Dude, Wait, hold on. Before we get too far into the story, I have to show you this is what ten dollars worth worth of beef looks like at a Japanese yeah, grocery that's, store. Hey, is that wagyu? Yeah, I'm pretty dollars. sure it's wagyu. God. It's ten bucks for like that, that like that. That's sweet. Golden box of insane fucking like, meat. Oh, that's like that would be so expensive here. So expensive. Yeah, it would. Yeah, that's sweet. And that was at the grocery store we were at. But anyways, anyways, yeah, we, we would do we would do some Seven Eleven runs, and then we'll look at the how much we spent. We're like. Seven bucks for like I, a fucking bag, yeah. two bags of chips, drinks, and like a little like jerky. Rice. I bought the whole everything. store one time. I bought the whole store one time, and it came out to like two thousand yen. That was like fourteen dollars. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, holy shit! Yeah, it's very cheap to eat there. But okay, so now we're all at the train station, right? And this is a, a it's a domestic, or it's like a I don't know how to explain it, but there's like lines that go inner city, basically. So like the bullet train goes to to big cities, like from Tokyo to Osaka or Tokyo to Kyoto, whatever. That one's easy because it's very tourist friendly because that's what most people are going to be doing when they go to Japan through the yeah, JR, the Japan Rail Pass. Outside. Inner city on the trains is like, it's a little bit more difficult. Once you get it, you got it, but we didn't have it. And uh, it took us like probably like 20 minutes of talking to one of the guys that worked there to help us figure out that's how to, scary, fuck, to get that back to the hotel. Nowhere. Yeah. Um, he like opened up the booth yeah, and like no, stood up Cage through the was kiosk. Saying it. Cage was saying there are guys in holes in the wall and y'all didn't believe him that's guys real. in holes in the Dude, wall there are literally yeah. holes in the walls and they like, came out of the wall okay imagine this imagine you're at a train station right you see a panel in front of you do, 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 do. there's a little hatch right here oh yeah do, do, do. he did oh, <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> grabs he pulls you in but we eventually yeah. all got tickets to get back to where we needed to go there was like four different trains we hopped on and we literally got on the last train that was running that night to get to like where we needed to go. Like we were literally on, I don't know if you guys knew that but we were, we were, yeah, on, we the were last on the last one. one. Yeah. Yeah, we were. It was like, it was like 10 30, 11 PM. There was no more. Mm -hmm. And if, if we, we didn't get that, on that, yeah. we had to walk nine and if a half hours. If we missed that back. train, we would be walking. I have to pee. There's like no way. And we made it by I'm five minutes. Five. You always, pee. you always have to pee. I don't it know was, what I would have done if we missed. I would have been like depressed, I think. Like I didn't even want to walk. I, I don't know what we would have done. That was walk nine hours in Japan. Crazy night. We'd have to walk through the highways, wouldn't we? Yeah, we were yeah, far. We were. we were very... I think we were, like, probably 40 miles away. It would have been, like, a time-lapse. Like, a time-lapse of us, like, doing different fucking things, walking around. The time's, like, the days are flipping. I would have started hitchhiking. I'll be real. It would have been pretty bad. But honestly, okay, I don't even know. I don't know. Because I think what I was thinking at the time was that, well, I'm going to walk far enough until my Uber works, and then I'm just going to Uber... That's what my plan there. was. Then, yeah, we yeah. probably would have walked four or five hours until we got near, like, Tokyo Skytree area. Then we would have been able to Uber back to where we need yeah, to go. Yeah, I mean, so we're all, ready all to of walk. This, all of this, <laughs> yep. for the most part, is going to be on video, which will be explained a lot better 
than Mo- dude, how we are doing. But. Most of it was like I was fueled off of the anger that I got from arguing we with that guy for ten off. minutes. So that I would have the wrath of I think God everybody was everybody in, in the trip got really mad at, at one some point or another. Yeah. Well, I don't remember a time. Wait, Larry, were you mad? No, not really. I was gonna take. Oh, I got mad one time. We already know. Yeah. I don't know if I was really mad or if I was like mega troll to make make other people angry. No, yummy. You were you got so mad you started being like crazy silly when I came in to find you. You're like, oh wait, I forgot. I love. I forgot. I forgot. I was just talking about being so mad, and then I said I don't think I got mad. No, I was. Yeah, I was so so mad during that point. I'm pretty sure I was about to litter. I was so mad I was about to. I didn't do it, but I was like, like, on the, I was on the brink. I was like, dude, I'll throw my drink down right I'll here. Throw it on the ground right now. I was like, that's I was like, like horrible sin, dude. That is <laughs> I was like, yeah, yeah, over to Japan. Litter. Yes, over to Japan. You can't do that. I was like, dude, I'll I'll throw it down. I swear to God. No, to be honest, I, I haven't like I, as I said, I didn't get that mad, but I did get really mad <laughs> last night because oh, yeah, no, no, oh, before that, oh, before that, before that, before that, before that, before that, before that, no, 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 let Larry talk. No, I want to talk. Deserve what? to speak. What? What the fuck? Shut the fuck oh, up. Hold on. No, no, no. All right, all right. Yummy, yummy. Present. Smoking smoke cigarettes. Say some backstory. I'm gonna no. walk in like a wrestler. What the? No, you are not allowed to speak. You had lost your what privilege about, to speak after last night. I just want to talk to fucking Grunk. Goddamn. Look, been he's talking smoking about cigarettes. Japan. What? Okay, tell him. Tell him. Grunk broke his ankle. Sorry, guys. I had to <laughs> tell it. Okay, look. There what? comes Larry. Isaac, give the introduction to Grunk so he knows what's going on. Okay, Grunk. Isaac is a psychopath. I just wanted, yeah, to, I just wanted like to ask Grunk how was like fucking like he was talking about how much he changed in the past two weeks, and here we are still. T- look at him; he's so fucking in character. He's like a wrestler. He's literally smoking cigarettes now. We've missed him for so long. Larry, Isaac's diverting the conversation. He won't talk he about. Doesn't it. want to talk about Hello, it. everybody. I'm fine welcome talking to... about it. I don't care if we talk about it, but it's the most welcome. Biggest, it's the biggest bullshit ever. To the no, dumbest. it's not. Welcome to the dumbest conversation you're about to hear on human. History, all right? Everybody, get your oh, rocks. Yeah. Welcome back to the get dumbest your rocks conversation get your picture ever. Ready. Okay? All right, here we go. All right, here we go. So here last we go. Night. All right, so, so... I'm gonna start it off like this. Okay. So, I'm, uh, wait, can dude, I start like it? This it started, like, oh, my God. It started with me. It started with my idea. Because I, okay. I was sitting there, and I was hungry and tired, and I was also thirsty. Um, Isaac was heating up his pizza that he was ready to eat. He ate a slice, and I was like, Isaac, okay, can we go get beef jerky? Already. We're already halfway in. We're already missing the backstory. Okay, so... <laughs> Yummy gets a piece of pizza. He gets a big pizza. It's a Tuscan pizza. It's a really great pizza. Oh, you're talking about he when we were half that pizza. pizza. Yes. He, he, ate, he ate his pizza. He put it in the fridge. I bring it out. I'm like, Yummy, can I have a piece of pizza? He's like, yeah, man, you can have a piece of pizza. I take that pizza out. I put it on my plate. I open the microwave, and some goddamn four-brained idiot decided to leave, like, three pieces of pizza in there. He heated it up, and it went to bed. Tanner, that was you. Oh, yeah, fuck. my pizza that I paid $30 Papa for, Papa Murphy's. I was going to eat it that night. I'm like, all right, I'll save this when I'm hungry again, when I'm just chilling. Right, and then you... I put it in the microwave, and I went up to my room. And you went to bed. And I fell asleep on accident. Yeah. So yeah, it, was, it was me, Isaac, and Larry awake, okay? Okay, yep. here yep. we go. So you ready? Isaac has the three pieces of Tanner's it. pizza and my piece. You ready for right? it? Right? Is that correct? What? Say it again? You have three of Tanner's pieces from the microwave in my piece, making no, four wrong. slices of pizza. Already wrong. See, this is why I'm telling the story. You're not telling the story anymore. You You're guys stupid. Yummy. After you I tell the story. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! You I was get, asleep, Larry, by the way. Larry, I does no he have any room happening. Happening. to talk? Does he have any room to talk about anything at all? I don't even think so because here's what yes, he does. Yes, he fucking does. Because I got we the story have, down. Have, you okay, guys don't. So you don't know. We have all day. Oh my god. Okay. I keep listen to my words. Oh my god. I take Yummy's piece of pizza. I put it on the plate. I open the microwave. Tanner's pizza's in there. I take. Tanner's pizza out, and I'm like, you know Decide what? To take this my guy's pizza not going to eat this pizza. So I take two of Tanner's pieces of pizza of the three that were in there, and I put them on the plate. I heat them up, and I start eating it. And then Fat Baby McGee down here is like, let's go to the gas station. I'm like, yeah, Dude, I wanted beef jerky. Fuck yeah! So we're going to the gas station after I have my first piece of pizza. And it's like what four, three, four a.m. It's the middle of the night. It's the middle Tanner's of the night. Tanner's been asleep okay, for like three you hours. Continue, I gotta describe oh, what okay. I'm doing as well Let because at this point, so I was making, I was making chicken. Okay, so the whole time I was in the kitchen, I was on the stove and I was making this fucking chicken. All right, all right. So I grabbed the leftover chicken, whatever the fuck I put it in, the, I put it in the trash can. I, I'm like, okay, well it's raw chicken. I don't want to keep it in the kitchen, so I throw it away. I, I, just I throw it outside. All right, and I come the back. trash out. I come back, right? I, the chicken's ready. It's done. So I'm pack, I'm putting it in my little like little things, right, for later. All right. At this point, I hear, "Let's go to the gas station and get yep. some jerky." I'm like, "Dope." Yep. Okay. So I, I stack all my little plates that I have. I try yep. putting on my shoes, and then we head off. Okay. Yep. So okay. now at this what point, I have to do? we're okay. at the gas station. We're okay. at the gas station. We get our shit. I Shut come up. back. 
What the fuck are you talking about? You My story. Are, now, this is where everything goes wrong, and you aren't allowed to speak for the next no, th- 30 yes, minutes I on the podcast. Because I know you guys are going to throw in some dumb bullshit, and I'm going to have no, to yell to get Larry, my attention back. Larry, we no, walk no, into Isaac, the house. Larry. No, Isaac, we Isaac, walk Isaac, no, into the are... house. Larry. I go to look for my pizza with my Holy jerky, shit. and there is Holy one shit. piece of pizza. Okay, there you go. Okay, there's one piece of pizza. At this point, at this point, me... And Yummy are sitting down, look at their little goodie bags that we got. So Yummy's on the couch, and I am on the beanbag. Isaac goes, all right, who's the funny <laughs> guy who took my pizza, pizza? I look at Yummy, I go, what? He's like, what? And then it, he's like, oh, real funny, guys. And this is where it fucking starts. This is, no, Isaac hold on, starts hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. himself hold into on. the psychotic no, thing. No, 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 Wait, no, no. It was so no, bad. No, Wait, no. So for bad. the next fucking 45 minutes, I had to deal with the most, the two oh, idiot no, gaslighters. No, And the other no. one was Gas sitting there laughing no. the entire Gas time. Lighters. No. I disappear. Okay. I go into the, my room. I go oh into my room. What are you the gas Isaac? station? I, I'm going to leave the podcast. I'm leaving the podcast. No. I'm writing my fucking no. will. No, no, no. I'm writing my will. We were... <laughs> oh, yeah, he's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. We were gone. at the gas station for maybe 10, 15 minutes max, and then we come back home, okay? Okay, well, Isaac, hold on. Hold on. Isaac's so called pizza that nobody hold saw. Hold nobody on. touched. Hold, holy fuck, hold on. Before we went to the gas station, I went into my room, and I got my keys and my wallet. And this, it was my leading theory. Because I had left, and Yummy was stimming. <clears throat> he was stimming out the wall zoo. And when he stims, he gets so silly and so pranky, and he does a little jump, and he twerks, <laughs> and he does the That's Yummy it. as a memory no. pose, and then he starts jumping and shaking <laughs> no. his ass. All right, you can take that all you want. So but with that you information didn't even in mind, it. no, you're a liar because you're coping. Home, and my you pizza thought that it was Larry. Missing, my one piece of pizza with, with information that oh didn't God. even. Oh my God! Oh, I'm so you don't deserve to talk. I'm talking. Basically, so dumb. I'm gonna say something that's gonna wrap it up in a way really quickly to keep people's fucking I say engagement in this conversation. I gotta say Isaac too. was being a complete psychopath for an hour yeah, and no, a really. half. Dude, trying to Isaac, figure out who oh. took his pizza. Imagine Isaac going through every cabin and they'd be like, oh, I'm walking in the idiot's footsteps. Look at me. Yeah, opening the fridge, opening everything, opening this and that. Oh, right like, hour. I wonder where it's at. Dude, he was so he, convinced. He, he ruined he our was, snacks. He, Isaac, he ripped open our food and started yes, eating it. Yes, I was eating my Lunchables and he fucking flipped me and he grabbed me by the legs and he pulled me up. <laughs> that is real. Can you confirm that, Isaac? Can you confirm that you grabbed me by the oh legs and you grabbed me by my Lunchables? And I also aced, I started taking a Funyun tax he from, ripped from my fun, He ripped my Funyun bags up and he was like, no, are these Funyuns good? Yummy, are they good? Where's my pizza? We should put my pizza. <laughs> Then he made Larry go outside and me. He, and he was so like, bad. you guys are going out before me. We had to go dig through the fucking trash can. We had to go dig through trash bags out no, because the, the trash can. can. Had, they had raw there fucking are so chicken many holes. in it. There are so Just many to prove. You guys are missing so much information. Oh my you're God. missing yeah, stuff the whole stuff about me. <laughs> I have everything already <laughs> no, no, you're, you're, you're in the my last head. You're the last piece. You're the you last haven't piece. even come in yet, Tanner, because we dealt yeah, with you're... this for an hour and yeah, a half. So, fucking so this long is Canada what happened. So I need to explain. You're the last piece. Hold on. I, literally, I have to go from like point like before you guys are even. You guys are just rushing through everything and skipping all the major details. I'm sitting there. <gasps> I'm <gasps> thinking, <gasps> okay. So, shut the fuck up. I am sitting there. I'm looking at my piece of pizza, and there was supposed to be a second one. So I'm like, okay, what's going on? What's the big idea? I start shaking down my friends, and then it clicks. And I'm like, wait, there was another one that had a plate on it. And I'm like, okay, so wherever this plate and the other piece of pizza is, that's where my second piece of pizza is. So I start looking. I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm shaking my friends down. I'm, I'm opening the cabinets. I'm like, I'm on top of the fridge doing like the, the fucking hokey pokey looking for my piece of pizza. We're outside. Dude. We're digging through the trash. I'm audience. trying to find this piece of pizza. You guys have no idea. Audience. He's downplaying Do you know this so hard. Audience. He's audience. Audience. absolutely audience. not audience. downplaying audience. it. Audience. You guys audience. are audience. hyping audience. yourselves He's down up. Playing it. Audience. He was a you maniac. You know the feeling when you're right and anything you say just gets told that it's wrong, and you at that point you surrender. You just like you don't even know what to do at that. I was like, laughing. What do you do? What do you do when you're right? What do you do when you do nothing? What do you do when you're doing nothing and you get blamed for something you don't even do? What do you do? Listen. And they're so convinced that you did it. Do you know how many times? Crazy. I thought it was a bit for the first 45 minutes. I thought he was fucking with us because he was bored and he had nothing to do. And I was laughing so hard. But then he got serious because he started calling me by my real name. And then he started <laughs> freaking the hell out. And he was like, he kept grabbing me and like, like going crazy. And then he was like, uh, he, uh, what, what the fuck did he do that was insane? Oh, he just kept repeating this over and over. Like every five minutes, he'd be like, you guys are in too deep, man. You're in too deep. You can't You're tell me where the pizza is. <laughs> yeah. You're in, in way too deep, deep now. Deep. You got me? You got you me? You're in too like, deep. Where's the pizza? Like <laughs> you, guys are, you guys are sitting down trying to figure out how you're going to get out of this, aren't you? Here's my theory. Here's my theory. Here's my theory. Here's my theory. 
I'm sitting there and I'm wondering where the fuck my pizza is. Meanwhile, I have Larry who's looking at Yummy. Yummy giggling up a fucking fest. Okay, he was laughing. I'm looking at Yummy like this. By the way, I'm, I'm like, I'm like this. I'm like. So at this point, what? I'm like, okay, it's it's a fucking bit. They hid the pizza and they're not gonna tell me. But it got to Dude. a point where it was so it was th this bit was the size of Pluto, man. This shit was so we were so what deep into this bit. bit that even if Yummy were to reveal where the pizza was, it wouldn't have even been funny. So now I'm thinking, exactly. Okay, yeah, that's what I was. So thinking. why would it be a bit? There you go. I don't. And know. then I told, and then I told Isaac, I was like, oh, actually, before we left, I saw Larry run back towards the kitchen while he was laughing. And then, and then Isaac then believed it, it and then he got mad. And then he was like, why would you actually say that if you weren't trying to mislead <laughs> me and make me think that <laughs> it was Larry when shit, it was really man. you? Isaac, you it. Isaac was it out. Dude, Isaac was so mad. He was like fucking up his speech. He was like, dude, I ate two pieces of pizza. And we were like, what? <laughs> Did you say you ate two pieces? And he's like, no, I said I had two pieces. I'm like, you just said you ate two no, pieces. No, I did not. I never once said I had you two pieces. I never said I ate he two pieces of pizza. He, I said I had two pieces of one of them went missing. No. God you man. said you ate two pieces of pizza, and we both heard it. And we both freaked out at the same time. This is a two v one situation. I'm not happy for a anymore. reason because you were crazy. Oh, you guys are fucking idiots. idiots. And then out of my I, ass, I was like putting us against the wall. What are we supposed to do? What are we supposed uh, to do? We'll end up lying and be like, "All right, Isaac, we hit it. It's in the no, force. We no, threw it away, Isaac." Like, no, out, we're not, out of my ass, I was like, "What if Tanner woke up, ate the pizza, and then went back to bed?" As a joke. And then oh, Isaac wait. went up to his room, checked, and he was sleeping. Before that, you came to my room. You opened the door. Yeah, opened you weirdo. What the fuck? You sleeping. come in my room all the time. You fucking hypocritical yeah, but I'm bitch. Just sleeping. I'm I don't fucking care. sleeping. You come in all the time. I know you're awake until six. He checked it on you, and he was like, "No, nah, dude, Tanner's passed. He's passed out." The he only one who him. knocks in this house is Yummy, and God bless his soul for that. That's the only credit you're gonna get during this entire podcast because I'm not gonna let you sit here and fucking patronize me and gaslight me. And it was that's what it felt like for 45 minutes of my life. I had to sit there and start questioning reality. You were wrong. You were gaslighting us. Larry, no. can you believe this guy? It was not gaslighting oh, if I did. If I was in a relationship with you, I think I'd kill you. I think I'd actually murder you in real Isaac, life. Isaac, you <laughs> gaslit yourself. You no did way. it to yourself. Uh-uh. He was like, I'm not <laughs> even... <laughs> he was like, I'm not even hungry anymore. This isn't even about the pizza. I just want to know where you hit it. And I was like, dude... I think I I'm gonna die on this hill. I'm gonna die on this hill. I know both of you hit it. All right. And this bit is not even funny anymore. It's not far too long. And I guess don't even know how to get out of the bit are anymore. What are you doing? I was laughing. It's said. the hardest I've ever laughed in my entire life for an hour straight. I was doing nothing but laughing. Uh, dude, you guys, it was so it was so actually free to like fuck with Isaac at that point because he was so delusional so in his easy. own little like guess. I was not delusional. That's the funniest so. fucking thing because I was so oh dead. God. I was dead set on the fact that you guys touch my shit that I was going to find out who the fuck touched my shit. And not once did it ever cross my brain that Tanner came down between the 15 minutes we were gone, <laughs> took my pizza off the plate, <laughs> Don't took his pizza. Why did you say yours, it. dude? Don't say like yours yours in the pizza. first place. The most improbable thing of all time happened. It was actually Tanner who came down, brought the plate and all the pizza back up to his room with all the evidence. Word? Improbable. I'm sitting there using the logical brain that God has given me oh in my God. head. And the word is improbable. Oh it was God. improbable. Say, it it was improbable. I decided everything of what was in my brain. You wake up, you're like, <laughs> yeah. Nobody's home. No, the thing is, okay, listen, listen. <laughs> okay, listen. You guys went and got pizza from a different place. I said, no, I want, I, I don't want yeah, that kind you, of pizza. Yeah, you guys. So I stayed pizza. home and I ordered something called Papa Murphy's. There was Papa Murphy's back home. And I was like, oh, I want some Papa Murphy's right now. So I ordered my own pizza for myself, which was 30 bones. I was like, all right, cool. And I, pop, I popped it in. You have to bake it yourself. And I was like, all right. And I cut it up and I ate a good chunk of it. I was like, all right, I don't want the rest of these pieces. I'm going to put it on this plate. Put it in the microwave and maybe I'll be ready for to eat it all. Okay, then, Tanner, so, just but, a little heads up. When you when you save pizza, you usually put it in the in the fridge. I don't like it like super cold. It's so you let hard. you realize that that's like it was it in that bad. microwave for an hour. It, it goes it was like hours, really hours. Bad. You were sleeping. It was hours. What do you mean? Uh, no, I put it in the microwave at like midnight. It was like three a.m. It was there okay, for well, you long. made the pizza at like eight p.m. Or 9 okay. p.m. I yeah, always, dude. Right my parent, when we have pizza, we put it in the oven. We it's literally in the oven overnight. It doesn't matter. Guys, that's, that's like the smallest detail. I don't, know, it doesn't even matter. I know. I don't know what you guys are talking about. No, just keep telling the story. I put it in the microwave like I was born no, and raised guessing. how to do it, okay? He's, yeah, I know. But so I went up to my room. <laughs> <laughs> I went up to my room and I fell asleep on accident. I was like, oh, fuck. I was like, oh, wait, I kind of want my pizza now. So I went downstairs. I was all alone. I was like, hello? Guys? Hello? I was like, all right. And I walked downstairs. I opened the microwave and to my surprise, oh, 
All of my pizza is completely gone. Where the fuck is it? I look to the counter. One slice is eaten. They're on scattered on different plates. I'm like, who's manhandling the pizza that I had? So I'm like, man, give me this shit. And I put them all on a plate. And I took the plate up to my room, and I fucking ate it. I, there was one pizza that I recognized that was not mine, and I left it there. I was like, that's not my pizza. I'm that a good man, mine. and I won't eat somebody else's pizza. So I brought it up to my room and ate it, and I was like, all right, cool. Good and you day. Fell watched back the video before we got back somehow. I don't yeah, even know how. I fell asleep. I watched oh, like a binge with Babish. Minutes. I watched a binge with Babish, fell asleep, and that was that. That's so what crazy. I didn't under what I don't understand is first of all, how my friends tried to convince me that I only had two pieces of pizza for like forty minutes. My that friends. was that like, was I, like I did anything. Like I had it. Oh, uh, it wasn't my fault. You're, you were falling. You were falling for you. <laughs> fucking troll for so fucking long, dude. It was like free. You guys, Here's you guys were literally so oblivious oh that you almost God. convinced me that reality was like shattering before my eyes. Dude, and I, I thought was like, you were fucking crazy. Dude, do you know how bad I, really I was trolling him? Do you know what the last thing that I said to Isaac was before I went upstairs? I was like, <laughs> I was like, I feel really bad for you, man. Your entire reality is going to be warped for the rest of your life because you're going to have no idea where that pizza went. And then I walked upstairs. Dude. <laughs> you're the, the last. The he was, like, he was looking you. at me. Dude, he was sitting down. He, he was standing up against the fridge like this with his head down. And then the last time I turned around to look at him, he was like sitting down on the couch. He was like this. Was you guys there. were like that. I was sitting there yes, trying to were. contemplate you're what like happened. This, and then you were like. Did you? Did anybody pizza? drink alcohol during this? Because no, not no. Single. that's the thing. Not he was single. sober as a stone. stone. I drove to the gas station and drove back. Yeah, I didn't drove. have any alcohol. It's not a me. single soul. I told him. Like, I literally was so confused. I was like, Isaac, you can have all the pieces of pizza I have left, which is four, which is even more. That wasn't than he was even have worth it. Yours. That wasn't even worth the and satisfaction I get if I found the pizza. But okay, synopsis <laughs> of this entire story is that why are you doing? Even, Shut the fuck up. Why are you I will doing beat that? you to death. It was all death. your fault. You took Holy Tater's shit. pizza without asking, and then everything went downhill because no, you didn't No, the synopsis ask. is that even though it may look like it's the embarrassing outcome that, oh, you guys didn't hide the pizza, it felt so good to know that I actually was not tripping <laughs> on my fucking dick, and I was actually had two That's pieces great. of That's pizza. That's great for all of us, because I know that now, you know, we have this as an example for when you freak out again, Dude. and you fucking start grabbing my food, and, and you fucking grab my pants and rip them off, and then you grab my shirt and rip my skin off. He had his legs. He was oh literally my, up in the air by his legs. I was upside down. You're in a, I was upside down. You're in a but I was trying to eat my food. Was he was like reaching... Pizza. He thought that I put three pieces of pizza in the couch. He was like, where is it? Like, Dude, I was going to hide point, it in the couch. At one couch. point, Yummy, Yummy went to the plushies. He was like, oh, you talking about this piece right here? <laughs> <laughs> that was like 45 minutes in. Oh, my God. Dude, it was, freak uh, out. That was so funny, though. <laughs> Yummy was then, fucking with him so bad. The satisfaction I get for knowing that there was actually two pieces of pizza just far outweighs the embarrassment. That's that great. Wait, so good for you. Who ate? Pizza, my life. Who ate the other slice? Because I had three on a plate. I ate one. Okay, so I ate, I ate one piece, and then I had two pieces for to like I was going to eat it with my beef jerky. And I think what's really sad about this entire story is that I got like gas station food, and I left Dad out with Yummy's pizza and just went to fucking bed. Like I was so mentally drained, I just <laughs> he didn't left get to eat it all any out. of it. He wasted it. No, nope. and I was. You know what? Yeah, I thought yeah, it was yeah, a classic. Yeah. I thought it was a classic Patrick Star. You ate my chocolate yes. bar situation. Yes. <laughs> yes. He's like, yes. You ate my chocolate bar. And it's all over it right face. here. <laughs> yeah. It's all right here. You got the pepperoni. You got the pepper right here. You got the mushroom right here. Who had my last piece of pizza? Was it yummy? Ah. <laughs> And then, it was so dumb. Oh. All right, man. I don't even, you know. But it was, it was funny because this morning when we all woke up, the first words Isaac said to me is like, "Where were you last night?" <laughs> <laughs> like a police I was like, officer. I was, like, I was in my room. He was like, "Did you come out between like three and four a.m.?" I was like, "Yeah." He was like, "What were you doing?" I was like, "I went and got my pizza that I bought and ate it." <laughs> like, what was this? What did he do? What did he do? He was like, "Dude, dude, no!" Immediately, because <laughs> I, I was there to witness it. Immediately. The, all the relief Larry was my like, body. Oh, Larry, I screamed oh, at the I top of my lungs. You ran to my room. I ran out to Yummy's room. I'm like, Yummy, can I come in, please? He's and like, I'm just yeah. sitting there. I'm like, generate like, the pizza last night. And he was like, <laughs> and I'm just sitting there. I'm like, I'm like, I bought it. It was mine. I thought I was in trouble because I ate so much pizza. I'm like, it was mine. Uh, no, and then I had to, yeah, I had to remind. I'm like, Dennis, it's not your fault. I was like, okay. I was like, I was like, I'm not wrong at all. I gave you a hug. I gave you a hug because of how. Dude, I felt so bad because it, it wasn't it, it wasn't it was your pizza and it was <laughs> I can't believe you didn't wake up because Isaac was literally like, seriously, who hid my pizza? Was it you, yummy? Who hid yeah, it? it was Larry. So, dude, it no, was so I heard Larry so... scream one time. I was like, nah, and I went back to bed. I was like, ah! it was like Yeah, because oh, Larry was actually like trying to make I... Isaac stop because Larry <laughs> picked up that it wasn't a bit before me. And he dude, was like, it was Isaac! So 
I didn't touch your pizza, dude. I, dude, he, I had to swear on my family's life. Yeah, I used my, mom's life. I used my mom's real name. <laughs> I used my yeah, life. I used my like, grandparents. Dude, I had to. Just I to was like, that's not your mom's real was, name. He was like, that's not your mom's yeah, real name. And yeah, you were like, yes! Yeah, 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 that's not even your mom's real name. I'm like, what do you even know? It was. I had no idea I caused so much discourse. You could have woken me up oh and asked me God. if it was that bad. I didn't want to do that because I didn't know. No, because I thought Isaac was actually a fucking psychopath. I thought there was never any other pizza. I felt like fucking what's that guy from uh, the American Psycho, uh, Patrick, uh, some Bateman. Fucking Patrick oh, Bateman. Yeah, that's who I felt like. I felt like yeah. American Psycho. All right, well, God. but someone else right. killed my pizza and I had to God figure it out. It, I was dude. a detective. It's just, you know, I was so excited to tell this story, but now it's just, it just makes me like. I mean, that was girl, fucked up. Girl, that was like girl, a fucked up like, moment. Like, okay, Grunk, we need a story take... lifter. Grunk, can, can you tell lifter. us how you broke Grunk, your? This is, this is where you're shining armor. I don't got any lifters. No, 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 no. Listen, I just want you to tell. I want you to tell you every. Just tell, tell your life. Tell us everything. Tell us everything. Tell your life. You said two weeks. You grew up a lot. How did you grow up? Exactly. Exactly. Um. Um. So, I start with details you remember. If you don't want to say it on the podcast, that's fine. Yeah, you broke your. Oh. Um. Well, I got a lady friend now. So that's, that's pretty cool. Um, that's really different and new for me. Aww. It's fun. And then summer, I, I finished school. I'm done with high school, basically. Ooh, yes, sir. Um, yes, sir. Yes, then tell us. With all A's and B's. Oh, that a boy. Huh? Yep. Yep. Genius, son. We ain't got and no then, D's, man. We ain't got then, no D's on B. Mm -mm. Literally, literally, my third day, no, second day of being done with school forever, I fractured my ankle. <laughs> skateboarding. I was gonna say, tell us how you ruined your summer. <laughs> yeah, so my summer's ruined. Basically, I have to wear this uh, this air cast here for. Uh, Ooh. Oh, I thought it was a full boot. That's not. Yeah, bad. No, it's like it is that bad. But um, no, I have to wear this for like six to eight weeks, which sucks. It doesn't even hurt that bad. It's it's like. <laughs> It's like a myth, I think. I, the doctor literally lied to me because he 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 read the X-ray and was like, "Yeah, it just looks like a sprain to me. You'll have to wear this for like two two weeks." And I was like, "Okay, cool." And then and then he's like, "Oh, actually, I sent it to the radiologist who reads like five hundred X-rays a day, and apparently you have a fracture, and you're gonna have to wear this for like two months it looks, now." It looks like a sprain to me. You look at it, the bones like all fractured. Yeah, it's it's like individual. It's like yeah, it, the, it, it was bad. Bone like, sticking out of your ankle. Basically, what I was doing, I was trying to ollie up a curve, maybe this high. And I, I'm just starting to skateboarding, so not that good, right? <coughs> so mm. I'm like, I can do that because how it was, it was a slanted curve, and I was working my way up the slant, oh, and yeah. I was like beasting it, and I'm like, you know what, fork it, I'm gonna go for the full thing. Fork and it. then, fork and it. then I went for the full thing, and the board went out from under me, and I was in the ollie like catch position for my front right foot, and um, the board went out, and I landed on the concrete with like full force on a rolled ankle. <laughs> And I had like a golf ball on the side of my foot. It's uh, like, yeah, it was, it's like it was, that much. It was great. All, your, it was great. All, all of your, uh, all your skater friends like dapping you up, like hell yeah, let's go, Jack, let's go, Jack. Yeah, yeah. It was just, it was just me and Camden, and uh -huh. um, he, he was, he was laughing at me. He was like, dude, you're fine. I know you're fine. <laughs> and, and because he's like, your foot's like off. It's like yeah, falling off. Yeah. Like, <laughs> it's funny. I texted the group dude, chat. Off. I texted a group chat. We're in. I uh, just sent a picture, and everyone was like. Dude, that is sprained. That is fractured. Like you're done. And, and Ken was like, Ken was like, no, dude, you're literally fine. Like walk it off. You're gonna be. Okay. I thought it was. I thought it was fine. To be oh honest. no, I looked yeah, at it. Yeah, no, like, it did not look fine. Looks, yeah, it was like no, a bubble. It was fine. a red There's bubble. There's no discoloration. It's the only reason. Oh, the oh, only reason I thought he was fine is because like when I had mine, it was only a sprain. But then the fucking doctor told me if I broke it, I would have been better off because it would heal. It would heal better. He said if I broke it, it would heal better. Thanks uh, because I that, sweet cut it off, it would have been like... Yeah, so maybe your fracture was like a blessing. Uh, and maybe it'll no. heal better. I don't know. I think Dude, it, I, think I got stronger. maybe the, I want to see the x-ray. Because, like, that fracture literally had to be, like, a millimeter. Hairline. Yeah, hairline like, fracture, yeah. probably. Like, a little baby fracture. It's like it, a doesn't, it doesn't hurt to walk on, really, unless you're really stomping, you know? Yeah. Um... So, but it really sucks because yeah. I was enjoying skating so much, and now Aww. I have to like put it on hold for like two months. The worst think, part like, is like the mental block afterwards. That's gonna be like the oh, probably the true. worst thing. Yeah. Then, like, yeah, the like physical injury. Like yeah, because I I've been having so much fun going outside recently, and now I can't frolic around in the in the fields. <laughs> well, does, does it at all like <laughs> right like right now? I know you're not back in shape, but like right now, does it at all scare you to like go back and try it again? Or no, I want to. The, oh, the, thing, the thing, 
The I've thing watched. I was the most pissed about this whole thing is that I know if I had like two more attempts, I literally would have landed it. Like I was, I was right there. Skateboard was, community, right go there. get a marker, go to your skateboard, but hang on, and write I grunk have a funny all over. <laughs> <laughs> I have a funny grunk. Story. It's, it's I think we're watching, we're watching Thank Droopy, man. and there was like a, there was like a scene. What is that? Droopy. That's you, <laughs> daddy. Yeah, that's me. Oh my god. <laughs> I you were like that for an cause, hour. Cause like I couldn't, you know, you ever had growing pains, like yeah. like in your legs and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Um, it, feels it, it feels like that, just like like times thirteen, Ooh. and it's like thirteen. It sucked. I cause I was I was like walking around. I was like, yeah, I'll just walk it off. <laughs> Not, I could not walk. Drunk. When I was drunk, when I was fourteen, I was like super into longboards. I was like, I like riding around town, just hanging out. And I had a friend, and he was like, "All right, bomb this hill. You've been riding around too long. You gotta bomb this hill." I was like, "I was like, it was like a Walmart longboard." I was like, "Okay, I'll try." And I didn't know there was like a, so I was just like standing straight up on my longboard going down the hill, and I got these things called speed wobbles, like, like oh, where the no. skateboard, like, oh, yeah, I didn't, yeah. I've never seen it before in my life. Yo, when I got big speed ass, wobbles. Boy, <laughs> By the way, I was thirteen and I was like two hundred seventy pounds. Oh my pounds. god! Whoa! Big boy, I was big. They Whoa. set you up. They actually set you up on purpose. You and Nicholas were best friends back in the day. I was a big, yeah. I was a big ass kid too. <laughs> I got speed walls and I crashed my head on the sidewalk, no <laughs> helmet, and I got knocked out for oh. like twenty minutes. Oh, like a dog licked your ball and walked away. <laughs> and they're oh, like, my guy, you have a concussion. Like you have to go over wow. here. I'm like, I'm gonna take a nap over here. Like, no, don't sleep. I'm like, I'm gonna take a nap. <laughs> don't, no, sleep. Don't, don't sleep. Don't sleep. It'll be no. like, why did they? Why did they always say not to sleep? Get that flashlight on my face. Get that flashlight. There's no flashlight, Tanner. There's no flashlight. Get the flashlight out of my face. <laughs> you know I got told the same thing. I got told if I slept during a, a concussion, I'd go into a coma and I wouldn't wake up when I was a kid. What? Is that real? That was, yeah, I got, I got, I just yeah. like passed out. I, don't I, was think like, I true, knew but... I couldn't sleep. I was like, I'm going to take a nap. And I just passed out for 20 <laughs> minutes. And I woke up to my dad. I was like, AT, hey, come on. We got to go, buddy. I'm like, I'm like, oh. <laughs> you wake up this morning and you like <laughs> soup, <laughs> like alphabet soup. And like, I didn't know like I fucked up the hill. Soup. Yeah, yeah. But no. I had I had something called a contusion right on the corner of my my head. Maybe that's what's and it was like. I, that's what people say. <laughs> I can still feel it. It's like a bump. <laughs> it's like, by the way, by like the way, your by the family way. says that about you. Yeah. While it's not clear <laughs> where this idea comes from, it's mostly a myth. The whole sleep after concussion. Uh, it's a myth. Okay. It's a myth. So I was fine. It's folklore. Yeah. I got a. Uh, um, I got praise from all the skaters in my neighborhood when I broke my arm on my skateboard. I was in, when I was yeah, in grade. Like, that's, that's like a big. It's like a ride. Yeah, that was, that was my first. That was my first like bad thing that happened yeah. to me while skating. Like everybody oh, should have happened. Much, I wish but... it happened at a skate park with like people because I know they would have like picked you up and like they would have like know, took care of me. Like a trophy of you came out, yeah. Yeah, a golden statue <laughs> no, in the skate park. I, I wish it happened at any time other than now. I think because like that's literally summer just happened, started yeah. and everyone wants to go do summer things, dude. As soon as and, you're uh, able to, like as soon as the you. doctor says you can, you need to do like a bunch of physical therapy exercises to strengthen it back up. Because with my ankle sprain, like my senior year, it's like, not it was like really. That. It was really fucking bad. Don't no, scare him like that. <laughs> Don't scare no, him. No, you need to re-strengthen your ankle. It's, like, it's when, not even like that. Like, I can no, use dude, it fine, those bro. ligaments, that's not the thing, though. Like, when those ligaments and everything get stretched out, like, you need to, like, re-strengthen them and tighten them back up. Or else they'll stay loose. Like, they will not be, loose. like, as tight as you want them to be. Um, the, everything that's in there. That, no. That, my, like, besides the <laughs> fracture, I mean. Like, I could see myself, like... Like trying this again and then the exact same thing happening, <laughs> I would be, I would be so upset. Oh my oh, goodness, words could describe how it's like fine. Ugh, it's so annoying. Yeah, you have a good persistence though to like want to do it again after. I, that dude, I know, I know. Shit. Like, I this was is doing usually so when the good. skaters quit. I was peaking. That's usually yeah. It's exactly when skaters. That's when Tony Hawk. Tony Hawk died when he did huh? his first ollie. Did you know that <laughs> his head, Tony his head dead? came off. His head came off completely, and you know what he did? He got up. <laughs> Rusted off, <laughs> oh, back on. and then went back on, and he fucking nailed it. Yeah, then he tried to even it. I was, I was even thinking about like yesterday. I was in the same spot just because Camden wanted to go skate a little bit before we went and met up with our other friends. I was, I was like one second away from trying it again, even with the forked up ankle. Oh, no, yeah, dude. Dude. You were like, like to go the only, your skin, bone the only, <laughs> the only reason I did it was because I like I tried dropping off a curb, and like. I, I I kind of put my foot down instead of dropping off, and it hurt really bad. I'm like, okay, I really shouldn't do that. I'll be real. I gave up longboarding altogether after that fall. I never, <laughs> I never, <laughs> I never longboarded again. Yeah. Um, <laughs> what about when Isaac got his? You want to try oh, it out? Oh, were you I did scared try it when out. he? Were you, uh, <laughs> I, I, no, every time I see a longboard, I just remember when I fall. I'm like, shit, I just fucking fucked my head up. I was like, yeah. I'll, I'll try one. Yeah, that was like the first time I picked up a longboard. 
telling me about a story. He he has his driveway is like super steep, and um, he can skate <laughs> down it fine. But he had he had this friend, <laughs> and literally like they just started their day. They were like going out to the spot, and and, it, and his friend tried to roll down his driveway, and it's like it's like a straight to flat ground type thing. Oh, and and his friend. <laughs> His friend ate it and just ate it, like completely <laughs> ate it. And and he said he went quiet and he had to walk him home and he was like sobbing on the way home. Uh, <laughs> the, I'm not gonna lie, I would I was an asshole. I would have laughed hysterically at kids who would fall forward when they're doing this. <laughs> like you know, you know, you know the fucking like like yeah, flat ground fucking like master. And it's like and it happens for so long too. Like there, I remember in middle school, dude, in middle school there was you, you know like the ramps for like uh, kids with like, like wheelchairs and shit. Like there was a kid um, running and he tripped and he was just that doing that for like a good, it felt so long, dude. It felt like it was happening for so long and I was crying on the floor like laughing when he like fucking fell in his shit. Oh, dude, dude, it was so fucking funny. Like, dude, I don't know. Or, I was sorry. gonna say the, the first time I went to a skate park because we were talking about skate parks and we were talking about like, crying. I cried the first time I went to a skate park when I was ten. <laughs> I was ten years dude. old and uh, like where I where I grew up, skating wasn't really a thing. It, like, it wasn't big. Like South Georgia, like nobody fucking skates. Everybody plays like football and basketball. But then I moved up to Idaho for six months, and skating's huge up there. It's like skating and cars are like the two things, and like smoking cigarettes and like meth and shit. <laughs> but I went to a skate park. And I was the youngest one there by far. Everybody was, like, probably, like, 16, 17. But when you're, like, 10, that looks like they're, like, 80 years old. Like, they yeah. seem so much older than yeah. you and, like, yeah. like scary. And uh, I just kept trying to, like, do anything. I, I was, like, decent. Like, I could ollie or whatever. I, I was, like, almost able to kick flip. I could I could do, like, pop shove and shit. But I was, like, really nervous because everywhere I was riding, people were just going, like, vroom, all around me. And there was this one time where I was, like, going down this little ramp, and there was a dude that was coming on the same direction as me, and he was trying to go ollie up the staircase next to the ramp. And, like, he, like, got off his board and started running next to it because he saw me coming. And he was like, God fucking damn it, dude! And I was like... <laughs> and I just, like, literally... I just, like, skated to, like, one of the picnic tables. I just started crying because I got so scared. Oh, this guy was going to, like, kill me. No, I, he got I so mad. I, was, yeah. I got really scared when I saw, like, a group of people skating. I waited for no, them all too, to leave just dude. to skate. Me too. I was there so are anger terrified. issues in the skate community. Yeah, some, dude. some of them, some of them, some of them are really, really sweet though. Some of them are like really. They're either chill nice. or they they killed somebody. It's, it's yeah, yeah they, they want to kill between. everybody. Yeah. It's never in between. Yeah, the first time I went to a skate park with my friends, they knew how to skate. I didn't know shit, and the whole time I think I sat there daydreaming about me skating really cool and like showing off in front of them. And then by the time I was done with like daydreaming, they're already gone. I'm like, all right, well, let's go back home. <laughs> I didn't Aww. do shit. I just sat there looking at the fucking park, like imagining myself doing all this shit. Yeah, but, I don't know. The last time I had like a like an incident or like an accident like that, it was really funny. It was um after this like uh this little this whole fucking breakup thing I had, I was like I'm gonna rebuild myself. So I started picking up biking again. <laughs> I started biking and 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 so I, there's this like really easy path to the park, right? But there's a part in the street where it, it does this like this big dent. There's like this big like ooh, right. So I. You know, first day, I'm doing this whole rebuilding, whatever the fuck. You know, it was so dramatic. I was going down that thing. I had a hat on, and I was going down really fucking fast. My head flies back. My first instinct is to go back and grab it. As soon as I twisted, I knew. I was like, uh-oh, why'd you do that? And then instantly, I fall sideways, and I skid across the fucking pavement on the ground, okay? And so, I'm on the ground, okay? I'm on, I don't even know how to mimic that. I'm on the ground. <laughs> I'm on the fucking ground on the pavement and I, I go to grab my hair. I look I look down. I have like denim, like denim pants. I have this jacket. My jacket's like ripped right here. It's all ripped. And then my pants are all fucking ripped on the side. And I'm like walking. And, I, and then it's it's that growing pain where like you feel nothing at first. And then it starts coming in real slow. And I'm like, and, Ow, Ow. And, and, and I'm and I'm walking because I'm scared that if I move any weird way. I'm gonna like break something. <laughs> so I'm, so I'm, I'm walking on one side, like all still, like this. And I'm walking around the neighborhood. I'm like, oh my God, I need to get somewhere quick. I need to wash this shit off. And dude, the, one of my, one of these, uh, there was this girl, <laughs> there was this girl who goes to my school and she just happened to live um, in the house that I was like right in front of. And she was like outside waiting for her friend or whatever the fuck. And she saw me. She's like, aren't you that kid who goes to my school, whatever the fuck? She said my name. And then I didn't, I didn't know who she was, but I was like, yeah. Oh, I, I've seen you. I've seen, I don't know who she was. I've seen you before. <laughs> could I? Could I? Um, could I use your phone to uh, call my cousin? And then can I also clean up this blood and whatever the hell? 
She's like, yeah, it's fine. So I walk in, and her mom instantly sees like all like the blood that I had here and all all, all that shit. And she brings me in. And she and she like kind of grabs me like this. She's like, are you okay? Are you running from somebody? I'm like, no, I, I, no, I'm, I was like, no, I had an accident. I was riding my bike and I, and I fell and it was just like, okay, do you need me to call somebody? Like, like, like I'm like, no, I'm, I'm like, I'm dude, no, I'm that, fine. that kind of comforting when I was younger would make me want to cry out of like just being so uncomfortable. I didn't know how to react because I hated that when people would like over, like over comfort oh, yeah. you. Yeah. You just, I, yeah. It was so awkward for me. It would make me want to just like cry. I don't know. It was weird. Yeah. I mean, I, I just thought, I, I, like, I, I get that. I get that. She was being How really nice you, about it. Um, this was not, uh, actually, wait. It was, was like it was two like, weeks ago. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was in my, between freshman and sophomore year. Oh, okay. That would have been so, fine. Around but, like, year. middle school, dude, that would have, like, made me feel so weird. Yeah. Oh, no, if I was younger, I would have been kind of, like, scared of low key. But, yeah, that was, that was uh, the last time I've had anything similar with bikes, skateboards, anything like that. It was just that. Yeah. But it was pretty funny. It was pretty funny now that I look back at it. All I've been watching is skate videos. Like, they're so, they're much so fun. fun. They're so good. Like, they're very sick. Godspeed you, Genesis 3. Godspeed is a yeah. classic fucking video. When I was getting into uh, skating, I was only watching illegal, illegal Civ. Those illegal guys. Civ, yeah. Um, all, the, all the Thrasher pop-ups are really cool. There's this one Dolly. guy. I don't know who the fuck he is, but he's really, really short, and he has brown hair, and it's, like, messy. And he did, like, this... <laughs> I don't even... <laughs> dude, no, no, hold on. He did, like, a 20 staircase Jaws, like, jump. Yeah. I don't know. He's nuts. Jaws? He's nuts. Mm-hmm. I don't know who he is. There's also a kid who has his head like spray painted and it's like shaved and bleached with like red. And he's like 11 and he's also. Yeah, like, dude, shit. that that is weird. Like, I find that really weird and off putting because like he's always wearing this like, like punk, like super hardcore punk clothes and he's only like 12 years old. Oh my God. It's, it's like, it's but he's very strange to see. Dude. He, he is really like, crazy. Dude, there's oops. one. Did you see that one clip of him? Where he was trying to grind off that rail, and he just face? like slammed his head on the ground, like literally yeah. as hard and he as gets it. Up and he's he fine. Yes, bro. Like yeah. they can eat shit and take it. It's crazy. Yeah. I don't they know. Can eat it. Crazy. Oh. Hey, what boxing. the hell are you doing? What? Your finger in something. <laughs> I'm playing oh, with a super cube. <laughs> <laughs> what is a super cube? Is that just ultimate <laughs> autism overload ma- toy machine? Why is there a key, bro? The look, key look, is so look, look, just look. not necessary. Yes, it is. Look, the key doorbell. I'm not gonna lie. When I was literally switch, a doorbell. When I was playing with it, the key was the only thing I was messing with. See, look, look, look. You can unfucking lock it. Yeah. What is in it? Nothing. <laughs> you just Wait, unlock tenor, it, man. Tenor, tenor. Where did, did you, you get? Where did you end up? Freak. Did you uh, end up fingering out the little spring? No, it ring? comes oh. with a door stopper too. I have to take off one of these, put a door stopper on it. It goes. Imagine so like a, a, what is it? Just a fidget toy? <laughs> yeah, I for call the, it the super for the cute audio one. for the audio <laughs> listeners at home. Tanner <laughs> has one of the craziest. Cute, you know what? How the, much come, was it? Come over to YouTube. Dollars. Take a look at this, dude. At this. It is that is a lot. Oh look, God. it's got a switch. It's got a switch. It's got a light if switch. If you gave this got to a, a skateboard baby, wheel. they would be, like, <laughs> look. entertained forever. Oh, that's, it, uh, that one's all right. That one's that's, all, that's all right, but it's got a faucet, too. Look. <laughs> oh, yeah, the faucet's kind of crazy. The faucet's kind of W. They're, they're but the keys, like just, the, key, the key does like, it for they're, me. They're not oh, my God, the key, the key is the only reason they I need, bought it, because, look. They need the popper and the thumb pad. I don't like the fucking. There's, like, a tub faucet. That, Dude, that's that's like not five. That is not oh, listen, you listen, are five listen, years if old. If anybody, <laughs> if anybody wants a real fidget thing, it's not. It's not. It's nothing crazy. Um, I saw Stop. it on Nick's. I saw it on Nick's keys. It's like it's like the little the little the manual. Yes, the the gear shifter is so fucking good. It's so good. He's I like the key. Forever. It needs some you of these shifter on water there. like a baby. Now you're playing with your stupid twenty dollar fidget toy. <laughs> um, it's actually take a little go go juice. Your little go go. Yeah, juice. it's good. <laughs> Look at this. Look, I got the faucet too. Hot water, cold wait, burp, water. Wait, burp, burp. <laughs> and I got burp and vomit on it. I think I need to unscrew something because <laughs> yeah. I want the door stopper on. How long have we been doing this? Like an hour oh and oh five. Oh. We're, we're two an hours hour in. and three minutes. We're two hours in. Yeah, we argued about pizza for 28 minutes, I think. We, can we, we call this that? episode Pizzagate or like the pizza? No, no I think Pizzagate. Probably not. No. Pizzagate. Oh, What's wrong with Pizza Gate? Gate? What? Why are you so sudden about that, yummy? Huh? What are you yeah, hiding? What, what, what are you hiding? Let's not call it Pizza Gate and have my name anywhere associated with it. Whoa. Okay, <laughs> it's actually hiding something. All right, I'm looking up Pizza Gate and Yummy. <gasps> <laughs> Do not look up Pizza Gate and Yummy. Do not look up Pizza Gate and Yummy. <laughs> Do not. Oh my God. Nothing. Cut it out. Nothing, all right, nothing. all right, all right. All right. This is classic. Nothing, nothing. Right. Forget about it. We're gonna be ending here, um, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for watching this really all over the place fucking episode of. <laughs>
the group chat podcast. Again, thank you to our sponsor, Gamer Subs, baby. Uh, yes, sir. Yes, Gamer sir. Subs. Ooh. Use code group for how much? For how 10% much? Percent off. 10%, 10 off. 10% 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 off. 10%